Okay, let's try to finish this up. I'm going to select my tire and my rim, hit the HQ to hide it. And I'm going to go in here and we're going to work on my brake caliper. So we're going to take a cube like this. Like so. Let's give it a few more segments than that. And we can give it that many, I guess. I hope that ain't too many. Okay, let's go back to our perspective view. Let's draw this out a little. About like that right there. Okay, let's go in now. And let's start trying to shape this a little bit. So let's go to our vert mode. Let's grab these verts and let's pull them in like this. Let's try to round it off a little bit. The best you can. It don't have to be perfect because it's going to be hidden by the wheel most of the time. Uh, unless you're going to be doing a great big close-up, I really don't see the uh, point, you know, in getting too detailed with this. So let's go to polygons and let me move this back out of the way for a second just so I can get in behind here okay well I was gonna I was going to bend that end a little bit but I think I'd rather do these right here so let's select these So, let's move them in a, just a little bit. Okay, now let's pick these. Let's move them in a little bit too, like that. And to be honest with you, I don't know if I like that or not. I'm going to move these back. So, let's go back into vert mode. Straighten these back up like this. Okay, now let's take these. And let's move them down a little bit. Okay. We sub D that, we get a little bit of a shape there. So let's go ahead and run a loop slice symmetry. Count of two, up and down through there. And now we're getting this little shape here. And you can go in and experiment all you like and making it look like however you want it to look it really is up to you pull those in like that now we're getting a better shape there to our brake caliper just take some tweaking Okay, now let's take go to polygon mode. And, like I said, let's go to vert mode. And let's straighten these back up once again. A little bit here. Now let's go to polygon mode. And let's select these polygons right here. Like so. Hit the B key for bevel. And we're going to bevel these out, like so. And we're going to do that a couple times. And 
And actually, let's deselect these and bevel just the middle. Over there, that's a lot better. Let's run our loop slice down through here. Tighten that up some. Now let's run the overall scale and thin it out a whole lot, like so. Okay, now let's mirror this. Over like that. We'll unhide everything. So, let's go in here now. And let's move these over. We'll put them on this side. And once again, I'm going to hide my wheels and stuff so I can go in here and tighten this up and get it close. Now you'll notice how I got some overhang here. I'm going to use those for a bolt. Let's back this up a little bit. Scale it. Like that. Let's get us a cylinder here. And then let's um, draw us a little cylinder out. Like so. Okay, now I'm going to take this, copy and paste it, and we'll bring it down to this side. Like so. Now it's up to you if you want to. Uh, do some decorating on this whatever you want you can do it's not a problem as you can see I'm just gonna make a little hole there like that that way I can delete this one copy and paste this one bring it straight up here now we got our bolts holding our calipers let's make our calipers red by hitting M and giving the material. Okay, there's our red calipers. Let's unhide everything. Now we want to make sure everything is scooted back. Like so. Now we have our calipers. Now there's one more thing we need to do, so let me grab my wheel and hide it real quick. Go to edge mode, I'm going to select this edge, this edge, and then on our way around to the other side, and I'm going to select this edge, this edge, push the up arrow, go on around to the other side like that. Hit the W key and I'm going to pull these out like this just to round it off. Like that and you need to do the other one too as well but I'm not going to because we won't see it so there we go there's our caliper our rotor and our wheel and our tire we can add some brake lines and stuff too if you want to get more detailed this is just a quick go about so there you go I hope you've learned something guys uh, now we'll finish up our Star Wars and I got a couple of videos on replicators and fur that I'm gonna post and uh, we'll see you then one final thing, I got a comment from a guy who said, hey, you're not supposed to have the same design on both sides. So, you know, point taken. So I went in and deleted the back here. Okay, so now you can see we have smooth geometry. Now, I didn't go over this in the video, but I wanted to do this just to make you guys happy so you all wouldn't think, hey, that's not right. So this is the final product with the empty back here and our calipers and our brake rotors. Okay, so uh, thanks for watching this little alloy wheel series. See you next time.